Hallo und willkommen zurück bei Quarku LP. Mein Name ist Quarku und natürlich zeige ich euch wie immer auch für die vierte Episode von The Wolf Among Us, wie man den letzten Erfolg kriegt. Viel Spaß! Als erstes schauen wir uns an, welche Book of Fables Einträge denn noch fehlen. Das sieht ja bisher sehr schön aus, alles gefüllt. Ah, zwei Einträge haben wir verpasst. Okay. Und jetzt zeige ich euch, wie man die holt. Um die letzten beiden Book of Fables Einträge freizuschalten, müssen wir zunächst das zweite Kapitel wiederholen. Wir begeben uns wieder zu Beauty and Beasts Apartment und spielen das Kapitel erstmal wie gewohnt durch. This all goes sideways. I'd like to know where it's coming from. Wir haben jetzt das zweite Kapitel so weit gespielt, dass wir uns wieder entscheiden müssen, ob wir zum Butcher Shop oder zum Lucky Pawn gehen. Und diesmal entscheiden wir uns fürs Lucky Pawn, denn beim Butcher Shop waren wir schon beim letzten Mal. I'm going to the Lucky Pawn. There's too much going on there to ignore. I'll have a word or two with Jersey. You know, Bigby, once you show your face there, word is going to get out. There may be nothing left to see if you go to the butcher shop after. Well, I guess I'll find out. Willkommen im Lucky Pawn. It's dirty. No, it's not. It looks like you slept in it. In a pile of garbage. Jack, Donkey skin. You... I've seen you take a torn purse for a tenner. Yeah, but I also got her phone number. I don't want your phone number. Ugh, oh, really? Whoa. Bigby's here. Oh. This is a surprise. Why are you never glamoured, Toad? Why is it so hard to just follow the rules? Look, I know some fables can switch from man to beast and back again like changing shirts. But it's not so easy for the rest of us to look human, all right? And anyway, so I'm getting the money right now. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic. So? And it'll be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem to me. Yeah, it is. And so I came here to sell it off. Da ist der erste Book of Fables Eintrag. Wait a minute, that's Faith's coat. It was Faith's coat. Look, you left it in my place. What do you expect me to do? Yes, I think the off-sited statute of Finders Keepers clearly states that it's his now, Bigby. So what's it gonna be? I don't know what to tell you. See if Cindy needs a coat. I don't know. <sighs> This is to pay for those bloody glamours, you know. You and your blinkered rules. If the witches didn't charge so fucking much, I wouldn't have to be in here dealing with this nonsense. You know, maybe Snow can help you out. How could Snow help me, help me out? Give you an advance, a loan or something. She's kind of in charge of the business office now. Well, the last guy who was in charge didn't help us much, so forgive me if I don't expect anything different now. <laughs> I don't know what you're getting so steamed about. Shouldn't be that big of a shock that I'm not going to take an ass hair coat. <laughs> no, I guess it shouldn't be, since this whole bleeding operation's just a setup for one of his shady fucking loans. Ixnay on the own lays. Okay, Og Frey. I mean, what kind of a game are you running here? Toad? You turn down people's stuff so you can peddle his shit. I know who you're talking about. Um, Og Frey? The crooked man, <laughs> right? This is his place. Those are his loans. Well, I'll leave you to your business. I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. Good luck with that glamour, Toad. Fuck off. Leave the coat. How the hell do you expect me to get a glamour then? It's not like I've got a lot of options, you know. Ich weiß nicht, ob ich Geld dabei habe, ich versuch's mal. Look, I'll, I'll give you some money, all right? You've got to be kidding me. Do you even know how much a glamour costs? I've, I've never had to buy one. Keep your money, Sheriff. I've no patience for charity. Noch nicht. If you're gonna be out like this, can't you at least wear a bigger hat? You know, it's getting old to tell the difference. Between what? 
between a business office and fables like a crooked man, who you purportedly seek to protect us from. Either way, I'm getting screwed. Drop by any time. We're nothing like him. He really grows on you. Look, I work here sometimes for the extra cash. It's something stable. Mm -hmm. You know, between more entrepreneurial bouts. And before you ask, I've never seen the crooked man in here. Neither hide nor hair and all that. In fact, as far as I can tell, he's never even actually stepped foot in here. But Bloody Mary works for him. And the last time I saw her, she had the woodsman's axe. So? So the last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. We'd never take something like that. Is this really why you came down here? The woodsman's axe? Because hmm. I don't know anything about it. I'll be asking the questions here, Jack. Okay, fine. Fire away. Because I'm not a mind reader. And unless it's bar trivia, I don't think I can help much anyway. There's more than just pawning going on here. You got the loans. What else? Maybe it's like a weapons locker, too. Was the axe here? No. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I think I'd notice a giant mystical axe. And that's saying something. Since, you know, Jetzt müssen wir Jack sagen, dass wir ihn zu umschauen wollen. I'm just joking. I never miss anything. Steel trap and all that. You wouldn't mind if I look around for a bit then. And what if I did mind? Uh, got it. Listen, I gotta start closing up shop, so uh... Close? It's the middle of the day. What can I say? Jersey likes to run at odd hours. Natürlich. Really, he'd be the one to talk to, so can't you just swing by later? It Nein. wouldn't be good for me if he sees your face when he walks in. So uh, I'd really rather you not physically be here if he comes back, you know? I want to check stuff out here first. If this is a crooked man place, maybe something here will help me find him. Can't you Shut just... up, Jack. The Jersey Devil isn't here to answer my questions. It also means he isn't here to get in my way. So I'm gonna take a look around. As long as I've got the elbow room. All right. Don't let me get in your way. I won't. Jetzt müssen wir uns nämlich umschauen. Und zwar, was haben wir denn hier? Kristallkugel, Pincushion. Genau das müssen wir uns anschauen. Reminds me. Briar Rose. You're not touching anything, are you? Oh, okay then. <lacht> so, da ist der neue Book of Fables Eintrag und eigentlich müsste es das jetzt gewesen sein, genau. Master Librarian. 30G. Damit haben wir den letzten Erfolg der vierten Episode und beim nächsten Mal geht's weiter mit der letzten Episode von The Wolf Among Us. Bis dahin macht's gut. Tschüss.